Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And just this morning, somebody asked me a question on Facebook how to do this, and she sent me a picture. And there was actually something at the bottom, just one word right in the middle of this circle that I broke apart. And this is, she wanted to put two lines on a uh, fit text a path. So to do it, and in her picture, the, the groom was a little bit smaller text. So you've got your text written. Go up to a range, break art, artistic text apart, grab your groom, and it's 76 or 77. Let's make it 67, so it's a little bit smaller. Take your father of, go to text, fit to path, and when you see that red line, it means you're in the center. Grab the groom, text, fit to path, and put it right below it and see that red line. Now, before you do anything else, because these numbers will disappear if you do anything else and come back to it, just press the left arrow or the down arrow button. It's going to move it around to the, to the right, but it's also going to move it away. Now, this one is going to move it back, the offset. And I don't think our red line will show up anymore, but that red dot shows up, meaning I think it's in the center. So now we can encompass all this or lasso all this, go to arrange and break the three elements apart, take our line, our circle, and it's a cut line right now, so we're going to make it eight points black. So it will not cut, and now it will engrave. It's a little bit... So you want them kind of between those words. So I've got my nudge factor set on 0, 0, 1. So just arrow down a little bit. So they're kind of like that. Take your two-point line. Move it around until it gets to the center. Hold down your control button and move it straight up. Get back to your pick tool. Double click on it and move the rotation to the bottom. Rotate it. to some degree, and let's go to 42. We'll just make it 42. Now this is where it's pretty neat. Corella will help you in math. Go control D and make a duplicate. And this time we want it on this side. So we want to block that out. We can go 360 divided by uh, or my, not divided minus 42 and it's going to put it equally on the other side now that doesn't look 100 percent right but you could kind of you can change it a little bit maybe make it uh, 320 bring it in a little bit it looks a little better now take your virtual segment delete key and delete this line get back to your pick tool and delete that line and delete that line and there you have it now, it looks like it's a little bit low, but you could always move your circle up a little bit. But it's really in the middle. It actually goes between those lines. I hope that helped a little bit, and thank you for watching.